What's up, Hustle Gang? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button to become part of the family. And if you are returning, thank you. On this channel, I'll talk about side hustles, entrepreneurship, and my soon to be debt free journey, pretty much making money. So if you're interested in that type of stuff, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. So in today's video is me uh, showing you guys how to set up a Shopify drop shipping store and finding your video. So if you wanna know how to do that, stay tuned. So let's go ahead and start and get into this Shopify store. Okay, let's go to Shopify. It's not really log in, start free trial. So this is how you start an online boutique with um, no money uh eventually it's gonna cost money but hopefully i'm recording this right I need a password we're gonna name the store shine on no oh that's already in you know we're gonna name the store wop with two p's no okay with three p's okay let's just name it wop store is already store the name? Wop Store Inc. Okay, Wop Store Inc. Boom! Got an ambulance going by. Sure, save my password, I guess. Sit tight, we're creating your store. So this is how you create a store on Shopify. You get a 14 day uh, free trial. Now after 14 days, I believe it is $30, uh, $30 a month. So you can start with $0 and then when you add your vendor, that's free they have a 14 day trial so you can start a online boutique with zero dollars but it will cost you eventually so are you already selling i'm just playing around <laughs> uh, no let me not say that i'm not selling products yet i'm selling just not online i sold yeah i'm selling i'm just not online let's just say that when would you like to launch your store i'll be ready in a few weeks how do you want to sell online only what is your current revenue? Let me just say that. I don't know. Which industry will you be operating in? Clothing. Are you setting up a storefront for a client? Wait, what? Are you setting up a store for a client? No. Next. I don't remember doing that. That's my address. Mm, yep. card number and whatnot oh no we're here okay so then what you'll do is select a plan uh, when you click that that's like which plan they have monthly plans as you can see $30 a month $80, $29 a month $79 a month and $299 a month I think I'm currently on the 29 but anyways let me show you guys how to um, add your store but when you go back to the home screen It'll tell you like, oh, add your first product, customize your theme, which is customizing your store. We'll make a part two of that video. And then add domain is where you uh, pick your dom domain name to see if it's available, like www.wapstoreinc.com. <laughs> That's my song, y'all. All right, apps. Let's go to apps. This is how you find the dropshipping store. Wait, hold on. Oh, visit the Shopify app store. That's kind of like um, the, app, the Apple store in your phone, if you have like an iPhone or whatever phone you got. So you'll go to the search bar and you'll type in CC's Wholesale Clothing. This is just a basic tutorial, just so y'all know. Hold on. That's actually the name of it. Of, um, let me go back to search. That's the name of it when you search on Google. I forgot, it's actually called online store, I think. Let me see. Online store. Can I spell my online store? my online store all right so here it is my online fashion store this is one of the vendors i did use when i was drop shipping like i said i planning i plan on relaunching next year when i have like everything in order but for now like i'm not rushing i'm trying to get everything in order but this is a drop shipping vendor you can use like it says 29 dollars a month so 29 plus 29 pretty much 60. um 14 day free trial and this is the store if you see okay unlimited access to your uh, to their catalog um automatic stock update daily fast shipping from united states free returns so pretty much you can import their items into your store so i'll show you guys let's add app you might ask for a card number you know what i'm not trying to get double charged for two stores 
So install app. This is how you in, you uh, this is this is how you sync uh, this uh, drop shipping store to your Shopify store. If that makes any sense. So you could use their photos if you want. Um, I wouldn't recommend it. You could take your own because if you're using vendors' photos, people know how to search your vendor, like reverse search image, like you know what I'm saying. So gotta be careful. Subscribe. So. Once you add your payment information in, then um, you will sync the store. But I'm not about to add my payment information in because I already have another Shopify. So I'll just show you guys the website. This is a drop shipper vendor I used to use. And they actually have cute stuff. Like, look at this stuff. Look, real cute. Just showing you guys the website. Like, let's see. Like, look at the tops. Ooh, and they have plus size, by the way. Sh uh, shop tops. Wait, what is the new right rose? Okay, whatever. But yeah, they actually have cute stuff like what these biker sh shorts are five dollars. This set is twenty dollars. Like, so y'all could sync this into your store. I don't, I don't see nobody on YouTube talking about this, so I'm gonna plug y'all. This is how you pretty much start an online boutique with no money. So pretty much, if it costs twenty dollars, you are gonna charge like probably like fifty for it, probably or more fifty five. I don't know, but um. Yeah, so this is how you do it. And then they have a dropship program, which is what you're syncing to your Shopify store. And click here to learn more. So this is where it says join now and it syncs with Shopify. And they have a tutorial too on a video. You can click that video to watch it. But this is just me showing you guys. I think you can even like somewhat brand. Um, if you use their photos, you can't really brand. I mean, starting off, just, maybe you could use them, but be careful. <clears throat> but they do uh, offer custom packaging click here for more info so pretty much i guess you can add your tag to it which is cool as well so yeah yeah look they got business flyers they didn't came a long way because they didn't have this have this when i first started you know but business cards tags um you see how it looks with the packing slip and you can put your logo and they have different packages for that um, be sure to also start an Instagram for your online boutique. Um, if you want to know how to get people to sign up for your email list before even launching, click this icon at the top. I made a video about that as well, um, how to get customers to sign up for your email list before you launch. So that way when you do launch, they are aware and they receive that email, you know? So pretty much that's the end of my video. Once you uh, insert your dropshipper vendor, which is what I just showed you guys, um, it's called My Online Fashion Store on Shopify. That's what you search to find it. But if you're on Google, you just want to search before you add it. It's called CC's Wholesale Clothing. I will leave all that information down below. If this video was helpful, do give it a thumbs up. It helps with my YouTube channel and the algorithm. I am on the road to 2K subscribers. So if you guys can like, comment, and subscribe, that would be awesome. And if you want more online boutique videos like this, help, side hustles, money, entrepreneurship, um, comment down below, subscribe. And follow all my social media links down below as well so you can stalk me on Instagram. Also, comment down below if you already have an online boutique or if you're, if you're thinking about drop shipping or doing wholesale or if you're thinking about just starting a store, period. Comment down below if you're going to do drop shipping or wholesale. Let me know. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.